Welcome, welcome guys to Tomba Special Edition. So, if you haven't heard of Tomba before, go look it up. I'm not fucking mad. No, I'm joking. Um, guys, we are going to be playing this Tomba Special Edition. It came out for the for Steam um, PC. And this is one of my old favorite S1 games. I used to play it as a kid, used to love it. Never ever completed it, never really got far because I was a shit kid. Um, at video games, um, I have brought a special guest along to enjoy the first episode with us. Maybe join us for more if you enjoy it. Um, Shivy, um, he's never played this before. And he's not no. talking. No, uh, I was waiting for an intro. Yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah, I never actually played this as a kid because I got into the PS1 very late in its life cycle and ended up just going straight onto the PS2. So many PS1 games, I didn't actually play much, and this is one of the popular ones that I didn't play. So I'm, I don't. I think this is one of this is one of these still games. holds up. This is kind of one of these games. So I don't know if like I might be wrong about this, and if I am wrong, please correct me. It was one of my favorite PS1 games, but I, I remember it being like a cult favorite. You know, one of them favorites that was very unknown, but the people that loved it loved it. Yeah, I never really heard of it. When I was I don't remember hearing about it. I know it's a very rare PS1 game now, so if you own a copy of this, keep it. Especially if it's in mint condition. Hey, you with the pink hair! It looks like it's on a CRT, I like that. Yeah, I've changed the settings so it's set to look like a CRT. I've seen these around before. You get more That's... detail that way. Honestly, I love that they put that setting in because the game just looks so much better because if it's clean like it they, I know they've made it clean for the people that like it like that But this for me just makes it so much more nostalgic. So the way they've done that is just so much better Well, if you need any info go to the small hut on top of that hill up ahead Crazy old geezer lives up there, but he should help to help you get out Well, you're going to be sure to check all of the sides on the way Local visit. Yeah, all right. I get it I remember him chewing my ear off yeah. as well. Um, so this game is a platformer, obviously. Pretty simple. The pigs are bad, guys. Um, your basic is you can jump and throw. You do get other abilities as you go, though. This is the fart. This is the uh, the fart peach. I call it. Oh. I was about to say it looks like an ass. It is an ass. It is an ass. But I, I remember playing this so much. Oh, he's back. <laughs> oh, heading off for the old man's old hurry. Unfortunately, there's a fog. Looks like we'll have to turn around. Do you have any oh, oh. Anyway, oh. Yep, yeah, I'm sure. Um, yep. Yeah. Do you ever get an answer to that question? What's that? <laughs> Is... <laughs> yeah, yeah. Is his hair naturally pink? Um, oh. I don't know. Do you know why? 
I like again. I used to love this game as 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 a kid, but again, I don't remember a lot other than <laughs> he just face palmed off the platform. Yeah, I don't remember much other Chick than the first. Quiet. If only it was that easy in real life. It never is. Never that easy to pick up chicks. I mean, the controls are really smooth for a re like you know when they normally remake games, the controls are normally all clunky because that's how they were on the on the PS One. Uh, oh, kind of like the Crash Bandicoot remakes where they changed the physics engine, so the controls are off. Yeah, because our friend saw that with that when he played it the other day. He really couldn't play it properly because the controls didn't feel right. Yeah, he was so. struggling to play it, wasn't he? Yeah. But this looks very responsive. It is extremely responsive. I'm, I'm very, very uh, impressed with what they, like, from what I can remember as a kid. Um, I'm trying to get to that chest and I can't remember to do it. Like that. It's locked. It's locked. I remember sort of what to do. You get the tornado, and then let's clear the fog. Yeah, I've got the. Uh, do you have to use the ability? I have to, I have to use the item. I'm pressing all of the wrong buttons. Oh, there's two you know equipped what? items, but it looks like it. Yeah, no, it's because I'm... Uh... There we go. I've, I'm so used to playing Nintendo games, I'm using B instead of A and stuff like that. <laughs> I, I have done that so many times. Ooh. I do like this music. The game has got great music. Dum, 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 dum. And those, even that cartoon, that looks really nice cartoon. I think they actually made a cartoon of Tom, but I'll have to look that up. But again, I, I will just say though, because I didn't say this at the very beginning, and I should have done, this game was gifted to me free by the developers. Um, but there is no like... Well, you got it through Keymailer. Keymailer, yeah, so... If you are a content creator and we get stuff, I'll put the link in the description below. You guys can have a look. Um, there will be descriptions and stuff. But anyway, back to the game at hat. So, yeah, again, it. it's a very simple like PS1 platformer. I think like, like picking up chicks. I'm picking up all the chicks. The good thing about this, it has like so like I'll show you so. Oh, is it select that I press? There is another button that I can press that opens up a a separate menu to change. The, uh, here we no. Oh, there's a rewind function on it. Oh, oh, oh! Snap. Okay, don't know if I like that. Uh, I guess for the. Uh, I guess that's more for the uh, soft player, you know. You know what I mean? That like people that just get. Yeah, this the alcohol. Is... Oh, I died, I died. I don't know. I'd probably prefer to play it as is. I mean, that function, I, 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 mean... I say now, I won't be using. Probably. You'll probably use it. Oh. Hmm. Yeah, okay, that's. If you don't make that jump, you go back to the start, but you do take punishment. I can't remember. There is a way to do it. But he's not jumping to the right way. Oh no, I know. You don't need to do that, that's why. He can climb walls. Just don't jump into the prickle bushes. That's a good thing yeah, for in this game. Like and in real life. You get these little fruits. Don't jump into thing. a prickly bush. Or the birds. Or try and Sometimes jump on them. Birds are... Do your character keep disappearing? No. Oh, I was um, oh. I was I was in the uh, invincibility frames. Oh. So obviously, when you uh. This is look. Looks solid, like. It's a you fantastic just game. Uh, no, so basically what happened is I go see the old man. So when you're getting to this point, you want to get all the chicks on the way. Um, what? Ah. 
The only thing that scares me here is you see that we've picked up chicks all of this time and we've been carrying yeah. all of these items. Where does Tomba mm. keep said items? Wow. Prison pocket. <sighs> you must have a prison pocket. So, like, this guy will send you on a quest. Go get the eggs. And... I've already got all the eggs, luckily. Did I miss an egg? Yeah. I missed an egg. Yeah. What egg did I miss? Yeah. Oh yeah, I should have four. Can you let me go, please, weird egg? Can you literally not complete the stage until you've got all the eggs then? So you need all four eggs. And then it'll let you go. To, so it's not, it's not like a so this isn't staged so so this is very oh try not to get killed by the eggs because i've just i just failed. wrong eggs try again right the good thing is they're quite generous with the uh oh fuck i thought i was looking ah the eggs are not nice Now, it's a bit weird. now, I was gonna say, oh, it's a bit weird you only have one attack, but you don't. So Mario um, only has one. No, he doesn't have one attack. He has this as well. I okay, do have like a ball and chain. That. No, I probably Your could. Ball and chain. So the thing with the ball and chain is, I'll show you the difference with the ball and chain is, it just sort of stuns them, so you can. I mean, it makes sense to use it. So now that you've got all the eggs, he's now stored all of his eggs for winter. Somewhere. I got four chicks with me. They were big me. eggs as well. They were big eggs. So when you go back to the old man, if you've got all of the eggs already, you don't throw you out the window. Oh, did you find the chicks? Ah, it looks hope. like you found them all. So where are the chicks? Oh! <laughs> really? <laughs> They were just in his mouth. How did he store four chicks in there? What? You oh, kept them in your stomach. stomach. Yeah. What else do you keep in How there? How are they not dead? Never mind. You just show me it's all right, really. Thanks to you, I have to one less thing to worry about now. Oh, yes. You wanted to see me about something, right? Yeah. So he tells you about... He'll tell you now the story. Once a beautiful, peaceful land. Until seven... Holy shit! They suddenly appeared and you had their powers to change this land. There's a voice that's in cartoon. For oh, some yeah. reason, the evil pigs seem to be collecting gold. I bet you gold the bracelet that was stolen by the coma pigs was made out of gold. gold. The seven evil pigs are hiding somewhere in this world. If you find them, I'm sure you'll be able to find your bracelet as well. Just remember, be very careful. There was also a number two to this game. Now oh, that's all the pi I know about the cold pigs. If you wish to retrieve your bracelet, you should make some friends. That'll be great help to you. Of course, it's a so Okay. So here now give me... And you do I was going to give it to you. If you find it, return it to Okay. In place of the bar, I can give you a key. It gives you a key. Oh, yes, you'll also need the evil pig's bag. Everything's 100 years old. Yeah. So now you get the, you got the key. What do I need a key for? You haven't seen me need a key yet. The only thing I've noticed, this game doesn't record quite well with this, uh, this setting. So you can turn that off. I'm gonna turn that CRT version off just for the, I mean, even like this, just so you can see the game. So we now got charity wings, which allows us to fall slower. Oh, okay. So it allows you to sort of. Is it one world? Yes. So it's fluent. So I'll show you. <coughs> that was fucking lucky. That wasn't skill. <laughs> Sorry. Oh. That didn't look lucky. Oh, I mean, in terms of I landed on the platform and not the. Oh. Uh. Landed on spikes. Oh, okay.
Oh, what? Okay. It's monkey. Don't pass me. Haha, <laughs> can you swim? No. I can't swim. <laughs> yeah. I thought so. Mr. Turtle saved you this time, but next time you may not be so lucky. You can't go past the door here unless you can swim. Trust me, you're not up to it yet. Come back after you learn how to swim. Hey, you hungry? Is that in the other chest? See you later. Oh! So there's a lot of things that you get in this game that helps you. So if you remember at the very beginning... If you remember at the very beginning of the game, there was a monkey... Look at it! Mm. Yeah. <laughs> uh, and he just gave me bananas. So we go back. Then. Shoot now. Ow. Come on, Mr. Monkey. How do I get you again? Oh. There's a way to do it. You have to throw yourself up. Yeah, there's a whatever. I can't remember how to. There is a monkey up there. If you look on the top of the screen, are you can see it. I did see it just now. Yeah. yeah. Let's we'll get the monkey for now. We'll just look for the hundred year old door. Okay. Again, this game's very hit like you've got to look for stuff. Okay, another cartoon segment. Mario Kart! <laughs> dun, dun, no, I, just wanted to, I just wanted to do that. So you didn't need to come that back here That is a car. That is a car. There, that was a car. If I remember rightly, because again, I haven't played this for a very long time, I don't remember the whole game. Which is why I'm looking forward to sitting down and replaying the whole thing. Um, there is, you do get to drive that car. Ow. Oh. Sometimes he jumps over them like flawlessly, and then sometimes you just. He's. Oh, wow, well, yeah, he was. I think you're um, stuck. Um, no, there was. There's a door. Somewhere. I thought it was there. There is a door. Yeah. See, sometimes he jumps like... This is the only thing I've just noticed. If you notice, he tries to jump on the egg when you're close enough. Like, look, instead of jumping up... Oh, I guess. So the kind of a movement you have to jump and then move after. Oh, wow, you were... So there's a door you're supposed to go through. You keep saying that, but where? I'm trying to find it. I can't remember where it is. Well, anyway, guys, look, this has been Tomba. I'm going to find the door because um, I completely forgot because I'm an idiot. Um, it is somewhere around. Uh, somewhere. Well, as a platformer goes from the PS1 era, this is quite in-depth. But the thing is as well, like is going this back is... to the same world, getting more abilities, going back. Yeah, no, it's definitely not as far back. It looks really good. I mean, I, even this mode, because I know the games it used to look as yeah. I guess. But this, I'm I'm sort of like lost in the nostalgia of it, or like. Yeah, the going back, getting upgrades, coming back again, getting more stuff would increase the replayability. Oh, yeah. I mean, I love this. I, I can see that. That's why I didn't do it. Right, so guys, yeah, what I just got there was the 100 year old bell. If you remember, the old guy, the old guy said, get me the 100 year old bell. It will unlock the 100 year old yeah. door. The hundred-year-old door is the door that I was going to, so I was correcting what I was thinking. Um, I just didn't proceed it very well. 
Okay, so I will push that through and get to the old man. Um, but we'll see you in another episode. Let me know if you uh, want to come back, Shiv. Um, you're welcome. If you're yeah, enjoying this. I'll be back on our videos. We'll see you again soon. Tomba Bye. out.